world famous, the world's narrow street. Son mentiras, son mentirosos. Son mentirosos. <laughs> ah, okay. Don't be late when you come to. <laughs> and my Coke Zeros. I was ready for my Coke Zeros. I always have my Coke Zeros. You make what? I know, you're sick in. Well, guys, I've gone barefoot now. Yeah. Yeah, you're sick in. You're sick in when the water comes and washes the sand under your feet and you kind of, you can like go down like that. Water is so nice and warm. Nice and warm. It's really great. This is beautiful here in Placentia. They've got beach, man. They've got a never ending beach. But the water is greenish right here, but it's clear. If you really, I don't know if you can make it out on the camera. It's actually clear, but it's a greenish color. Further out there gets dark blue. The fur out there looks greenish again, so who knows? Well, what a pretty place to be. And this beach goes for miles, look at that. Just keeps going. Never ending. Never ending beach. Just awesome. Yeah, it's tricky walking on the sand. It's tricky, a wave will come in, and it'll wash the sand right from underneath your feet. And then your feet sink down. A lot of little beach bars along here. Beach bars, little hotels. What a beautiful place. Placentia is located in the Stan Creek District and it's actually on a peninsula. If you look at the map of Belize, it looks like something hanging. <laughs> look at the map of Belize and then see where Placentia Peninsula is. Looks like the map has a ding dong hanging in front of him. And I'm not talking about the bill. <laughs> they also call it roosters, they call roosters that. <laughs> That's where Placentia is. You can drive here by road, there is a road coming here. But uh, people at the boat told me, it's a, a lot of people who don't have a car, they will just go to Mango Creek and they catch the boat at Mango Creek and just come on over by boat. It's a little quicker than go my car, especially if you're riding a bus or something. Here comes, where are you Maria? Sinking in the sand. I'm I know. It is hard to walk. It's, it's, it's good exercise actually to walk here. Really? I, I would think oh, wow. it's good exercise to walk on the sand. You sink, you sink in and you know you gotta struggle a bit to walk, right? So I would think, I would think it's very good exercise. Are people out here swimming? The water looks nice. The water looks very, very nice. It's nice and warm. I can't get my pants wet because yeah, yeah. I got my phone and my phone, I cracked it a long time ago. So if it gets wet, it's goodbye. I take care of my phone. My phone's pretty much on his last legs anyway, Pixel 6 Pro. 
want to get a new one, but they're expensive. So you gotta make them last and get your money's worth. Hope you guys are enjoying this nice, relaxing walk here. Hello. Okay, sell turtles. Let's see what you guys are selling. Oh, what, little bowls? Yes, we have the bowls. And you? Oh, the bowls, oh. Yeah, it's a secret turtle. I thought that was a turtle. It looked like a turtle yes, from far. It's a turtle. It is a it's turtle. It's a secret yes. turtle. Ah, yeah. Like yeah. Put it your present in time. Yeah. yeah. Maybe you want it to have one. Like I like that's a little, little wheat bowl. Nice. Yes. Oh, that's pretty. Yes. And you got necklaces? Oh, this is pretty canoe. Look, and it has a paddle that actually comes out that you can use. Yes. How much something like this cost? Twenty. Twenty dollars, Belize. Yes, American. Twenty U.S. Forty dollars, yes. Belize. Yes. Very pretty. And the hard bow. Maybe something and to help bowl. us. Yeah, I'm traveling, so I got no room in my bag. So otherwise, maybe a mask. I would like this. Something. My bag is so full, you wouldn't believe you it. You can use it for your butter. Yeah. For peanuts, butter. This is this is good for putting in candies. Yes, they are. Candies. Maybe yeah. something to help us. I, li I like this. This is pretty. Yeah. That is pretty, guys. Look, this is a basket. Yeah, we have these samples. Yeah. You can open it up. You can put yes, stuff in there. You can open them. See? Open. See, they are open. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Very pretty. Yeah. That's something like this. What does this go for? Yes. What does something Twenty? like this? 20? Just like the boat, yeah. okay. and this is like pot holder. Put yeah. your pot. We got the turtle also. You can yeah. open it. Oh yeah, it is a turtle also. Look at that. We have the hair clip. And a hair clip. Yes, with a turtle as well. Wow, the turtle is what? A hair clip. Oh yeah, how much one like that? Oh, with turtle. Twenty Belize. Twenty Belize, yes, yeah, ten US. Yes, that's somewhere. We have a runner like this. Right? We have many little items. Uh huh. Bad. You guys make these or you buy and resell? You make them. Oh yeah. Very pretty stuff. Yeah, this is this is neat too. Put on your hair. My only problem is I got no room in my bags. No room. Yeah, no room. I, I even have braces. I quit wearing them because it's just too much. Put in a car. Yeah. Yeah. Open it at the bottom. Oh, and hide some stuff in there. They're very pretty. Very pretty. I used to wear I used to wear a bunch of like braces like that kind of stuff. And I, I just quit wearing them all because it's just too cumbersome when you're traveling because we're traveling all the time, right? All the time. We're in Belize now traveling up and down one month. And it gets too cumbersome. Otherwise, yeah, it would be great. Yeah, very pretty stuff. So you guys every day up and down on the beach? No. For today. Oh, just for today. Where are you guys originally from? Um, Maya's village. Maya village, which one? Um, Big Falls. Big Falls. Oh yeah. Yeah. So you can stay like those guys. I know. I know. Yeah. I know. Business is slow. There are not too many tourists around right now. That's no. what the that's what the hotel told me. Yeah. You know, it's a good idea to make two, like a canoe like that. You take the coconut husk and you make a little canoe with that with sails and that. Yes. And that's like really local. And yes. some tourists might buy it. You make it so you could take it apart so they could put it in the luggage easy. <laughs> I used to make that as a kid. Is it rosewood? Yeah, that's rosewood, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I would like to buy some, but I really, I really don't have no room in my luggage. I'm, I'm like. I had to throw away a couple of things because of space. I know. So you could wear a necklace. I know, yeah. I know, I know, I know. I, I feel bad, I feel bad calling you over and then I don't buy nothing. But really, my, my space is like terrible. I got, I brought necklaces, I brought a bunch of things for my wrist. Not even my watch I wear because just too much stuff. When I, when I travel, because we're going to be traveling more, keep traveling more further, I'm like leaving even half my clothes. Mm. I'm just going to like take like two shirts and one pants and done because it's too much stuff. Yes. But it was nice meeting you all. What's your all's name? You're welcome. What's your all's names? Come on, Simon. 
Rosana. Rosana. ¿Qué es señora? Alicia. Alicia. ¿Y la mamá, no? ¿La mamá? Oh, just a friend. Oh, just a friend. Yeah. Oh, yeah. ¿Cómo te llamas, señora? ¿Cómo te llamas? Señora. Señora. Ah, sí. ¿Y cómo te llamas? Señora. Señora. ¿Te llamas señora? ¿Ese es tu nombre? No, ese no es tu nombre. ¿Sí? ¿Te pusieron señora? Ah. Eso suena como mentira. <risa> no. Son mentiras, son mentirosas. Todo mentirosas. Ah, ok. Pues, saluda a los ami tus amigos porque va a salir en YouTube. Mándale saludos. Aquí es el tip Austin. Yeah, I know. Don't worry. When you walk that way, there will be some tours and they're going to buy stuff. Nice talking to you. They want me to buy so bad, but to tell you the truth, I've got no space in my bag. Everything I have is just like crushed together. I'm gonna have to travel with even less clothes and less things. So I felt sorry for them, but I can't help it. I can't do more. You gotta tell them no. They want me to buy stuff, but I told them we got no room in our bags. We, we threw away stuff already because of that. Something weird happened. You see the guy back there? Yeah. I am filming a video. Yeah. And one of us, son, he just got out of the water. I started walking towards me and said, Oh, it looks like a mermaid or something. So when he got out here, I, I told him, I said, Beautiful day, huh? He just look at me and he kept on walking. Oh, really? Yeah, uh, maybe maybe it was a little high. Yeah, yeah. He had a barefoot and uh, bar uh, t-shirt. Yeah. <laughs> maybe maybe he doesn't like tourists. Yeah, could be. Or it could be smoking a wacky tobacco. I don't know what was scary. It was weird too. Yeah. <laughs> I got him on the on the, on the, you on got the video. Yeah, so got he'll him. be on your video. He'll be on your video. Ah, uh, well, this is a short I was doing in Spanish. Oh, just a short. Family, yeah. Oh. All right, you can put on your on your Where Are You Maria Facebook. Yeah, I will. I will. Put it. So you gotta check it out on Where Are You Maria's Facebook. See what weird movement the guy made. Yeah, the girls, they were a little upset that oh, I didn't buy nothing. Of course, nothing. because you're talking to them for some yeah. time. But, um, I don't know where to put anything. I, I got no room. I am so overpacked. I We actually threw away a few things because it just won't fit anymore in the bag. And then we ended up buying an umbrella, which is another cumbersome thing that, that we're packing around. But um, we don't have no umbrella in our house all together so we're gonna pack that home and take the umbrella along so sorry girls i couldn't buy anything but space is a problem when you are a traveler maybe what you should do is you should tell them ahead of time i'm not buying nothing but i will advertise it yeah for people to yeah. see you and then if they like your stuff they can come and buy from you exactly yeah. be sincere to them don't, don't put their hopes high yeah i will i i will i will throw you a rock also <laughs> yeah yeah, that's life. Life is rough. <laughs> Look at that view. Hey there everybody, welcome to Placencia. We're just gonna show you the hotel we're in. The beach is right down this trail. So when you come out of your hotel, you're very close to the beach. This is it here, Lydia's guest house. The rooms are here. And let me show you a great feature that this guest house has. This is pretty awesome. Right over here. I'll show you this first. They have, for all its guests, they have a kitchen. Look at that. Let me turn on the light. See, they have a kitchen here. You got a microwave, coffee maker, freezer, refrigerator, 
pots and pans, you got a stove, toaster, you got utensils, sinks, everything you need. Dishwasher, soap, garbage can. You can even sit here and eat if you want. Look at that. This is awesome. Having a kitchen, you know how much money you can save? You can save a fortune. Out here they got a nice little seating area. That's the backyard, I'm not going back there. I think they have rooms down here, I'm not sure. A little hand washing station. Then you go up the stairs here. Welcome to Media's guest house. Yeah. Look at this. They got a nice veranda here. Comfy chairs to sit. Look at that. Isn't that great? Lydia's guest house. And if you need anything, Lydia lives right next door. And let me show you what it looks like in here. So they have up here, they have six rooms. I think only two of the rooms are air conditioned. That's our air conditioned room. That's another one. Here they have some reading material. One thing also I really like here, they've got a freezer. Look, we got our ice creams for later. And my Coke Zeros. I was ready for my Coke Zeros. They got two bathrooms. You got a sink. Got a shower with hot water. It's not noodles shower head, but it works pretty good. Toilet. Window you open up. Very nice. And right across from this one, oh, they do have emergency light in case the power goes out. I don't know if the power goes out here. I have no idea. And this is the other bathroom. See, got them. Paper to dry your hand, liquid soap, sink, toilet, garbage can, same style of shower. Got a window open. Oh, they do have a ventilation fan up there. They have two more bedrooms here, fan cooled only. And this here is an emergency, emergency bathroom. Say people are in the other showers, you really gotta go. Here you get an extra half bath. Hot water heater. This here is the backyard. Beautiful Placencia. Look at that, very nice. And let me show you what the room looks like. This is our room, $85 Belize a night. I'll put the price right here, how much is in the US. Air conditioning, nice comfortable bed. The room is small, but you know, good enough. A little shelf to put your stuff on. You got a mirror. They have a fan. They have this fan, but they said it says there's a sign. There's a sign right there that says do not turn on the fan. It doesn't work. You got some drawers. You got a little desk there where I could do my computer work. Storage. I don't know what this fan is for. I was going to take it to the bathroom. It was too hot, but it wasn't bad. It's quite nice. They have plastic on the windows, keep the cold air in. They have aluminum louvers, you give them a little tilt like that for privacy, but light comes in. It's just awesome. I like it. We're very happy here. Very happy here at Lydia's. I would recommend you stay here, you want to save a little bit of money because we were looking for an economic place to stay. We have a Coke Zero for the road. I always have my Coke Zeros. They got a screen door, they say at night. 
lock these doors up and the back one too you lock it up at night we're the only people here we have this room hotel all to ourselves we got two and a half bathrooms air conditioned room oh the internet the internet is very good i can't complain about that so upstairs they have six rooms two of them at the air condition the other four are with fan i'm assuming downstairs is probably the same and this awesome veranda here look at that you can sit here like me just chill out you can do the internet out here if you want because the internet signal is very strong very good fast enough and look at the view you can cook your own food in the kitchen below come up here and eat got two tables lots of seating it's just awesome guys for 85 Belize a night not bad not bad at all with air conditioning I like it uh, if you're a digital nomad <laughs> look at uh, Pitbull he's hot look his tongue is hanging let me zoom in zoom his tongue is hanging he's going slow he's relaxing yeah and if you have any question Lydia's is right next door she lives right there she's probably watching me through the window right now <laughs> Lydia you got a great hotel gave you one two thumbs up it's good here we enjoy it and it's located right on the world famous the world's narrow street this is the street here the world's narrow street is actually in the guinea's book of world records i'm show you the backyard from up here look at that see the air conditioner there that's from our room good water pressure good internet good electricity good bed can't go wrong so don't make forget make it a date and don't be late when you come to <laughs> so guys make it a date and don't be late when you come to Placencia stop it stop in at Lydia's guest house the check-in is in the house next door downstairs just go there and yell or walk up the stairs knock on the door so let's go explore Placencia let's head down to the world's narrowest street according to the Guinness Book of World Records here in Placencia Yeah, a nice thing about staying at this hotel, it's not right on the water, but you come out, walk right down there, 100 yards, you're on the beach. If you stay at a hotel on the beach, you're going to pay the triple the price for pretty much the same thing. Oh, here, here's the office. Let me show you. I didn't show you that. See, the office is right down here. And they live right upstairs so you just come around here in the island some may come out and they'll attend to you so let's go explore well i hope you guys have enjoyed the video here in placentia beautiful placentia i took a 360 degree photo I'll put my Facebook link up there. Follow my Facebook and see my awesome 360 degree photos. And um, other photos too, I think. Let me give you a 360 with the GoPro. So you can see what it looks like. Beautiful place here in Stan Creek. Placencia Village. Placencia. Thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed it.
don't forget to leave me a comment until next time bye bye